Outside, Calvin Harris featuring Ellie Golden, Derek Shapiro for Derek Shapiro's Power Half Hour, Season 6, 2021. Look what you've done. Stand still, falling away from me. When it takes so long, fire's out. What do you want to be? Now I'm holding on. Myself was never enough for me. Gotta be so strong. Hi! Welcome. It's another edition of the Derek Shapiro Power Half Hour for the month of November 2021. Um, just me this month. Um, you will see River in the uh, in the trailer for um, a movie coming out Thanksgiving Day, um, which is starting over. Um, I think everybody needs to start over sometimes. Um, I had a lot of a lot of um, changes in my life. Uh, we live in a cranch on the basement apartment. I'm using this as my studio. Um, I want to pay homage to all the veterans out there for Veterans Day. Veterans Day is this month, November 11th. Um, also, want to say uh, thanks. I'm thankful for a new place to live with me and my son River. Thankful for my daughter that has a great job, and 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 I got to see her, her on my twenty uh, on my twenty first birthday, her twenty first birthday, and my dad that walked by here um, saw the place for rent here, the apartment here in Cranston, Rhode Island. So it's it's an honor, and pay homage to my parents and. Got to celebrate their birthday with them and 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 take them out for their birthday. Um, so their birthday was in September. My daughter's birthday was October, and actually, saw my I was I was at my sister's house for her birthday. So you know, pleasure seeing my new niece and 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 my brother-in-law. So got a lot to be thankful for for this Thanksgiving. Um, on this incredible show, okay, um, we do have. Um, Billy Gilman, and I recorded him back in September, and we both did a duet singing "Happy Birthday" to my parents. Uh, even though you know, hey, it could be other people's birthday in in the month of November. And it was Dylan Schneider's birthday, Bruce's birthday, who has been part of my movies, and um, and Garner is on November 11th on, on Veterans Day. Garner, who's been part of my movies, so happy birthday to all you guys. And um, in addition to that, we have Eating in the Car segment. And um, we do have um, me talking with Vinnie Bucci. It's been 10 years that we've been friends. Thank, thank you for our friendship. Um, so uh, we honored our friendship. We met in July of 2011. So here's this interview. It's longer on YouTube if you go on YouTube. Um, or the Derek Shapiro show, whatever you can see that. So, all right, we'll be back here. Derek Shapiro Power Half Hour starts right now. I mean, I'll be back here, you know, you know, in the studio, my home studio, <laughs> periodically throughout the show. Also, um, Derek Shapiro Power Half Hour on Derek Shapiro show to come. Well, on DSS TV to come, Vin the Booch to come, Radio to come. Also, all over Rhode Island every Saturday. Cox 13, Verizon 32. Well, on North Andover, Andover, Massachusetts. Um, North Andover, Comcast 22, Verizon 24, North Andover, Andover, Lawrence, Bethune, New Wilmington. Woburn, Mass, Comcast 22, Verizon 45. Goes Woburn, Winchester, and Burlington. Uh, we're on in Duluth, Minnesota. Charter Communications 189. And we might be in um, Cambridge, Mass. Cam um, uh, that's uh, Comcast Channel 8. And um, in Salem, Massachusetts, Comcast Channel 3. All right. Derek Spear Power Half Hour. All right. I'm in Warren, Rhode Island. Okay. And so I'm trying um, Portuguese soup from Amaral's Fish and Chips. Amaral's Fish and Chips. Now, the reason why I am um, um, having soup because I'm souped up. No, souped up. Get it? Souped up? Souped up? No, um, it's eating in the car. And, and so the owner says, you're not going to have it inside? He says, no, it's called eating in the car segment. So, so I, I, I told him I like port I like soup. I haven't had Portuguese soup in years. I used to have a friend that was Portuguese and, and Portuguese soup. And, oh, my God. 
This is so good. Ooh, wow, look at this. Oh, no, I don't want to spill it. Look at this. Are you souped up? Okay, so I'm going to try this. I have a spoon. Mmm. I think that's like spinach. Mmm. Oh. Okay, so I got, I got crackers. This always cracks me up. So, okay. Mmm. I love those crackers. Okay. All right. Take a spoon, just like Arthur Spooner from Kings of Queens. No, no, no. Okay. In heaven soup. Wow. This is healthy. Mmm. Wow, a lot of stock. Boy, if I'm ever sick, I mean, usually I get chicken soup if I'm sick. I think I had COVID last year. I have a cold. Wow. This is really good. Portuguese soup, onions, carrots. Carrot lots of one away from me. Mmm. Healthy. If this is good, I'm gonna try the seafood from the Admiral's fish and chips. Mmm. Wow, great stock in him. I'm gonna finish this with a little alone. Okay. Peace out. Okay, part two from the Admiral's Fish and Chips. I never did part two before because there were some other things I want to mention here. They have beef. Mmm. And potatoes. That's all I gotta say. All right, I had to do this. Me, Derek Shapiro, I have to bring you one of my dearest friends who's, I call my southern brother, okay? But he's from up north, by the way. But we've been friends for 10 years. Now, how hot that our friendship has stayed together through good times and bad. Like, okay, let's just put it this way. Our friendship has been there more solid than my past relationships with girls including i got divorced since i met him i had three or four other girlfriends since i met him he's had like two or three girlfriends i think since i known him um we we've had we've had different jobs that we quit throughout the years or got laid off um between me and him over the years we had so many movies that you can't see now due to my other YouTube channel got deleted. But that's not his problem. That's my problem. But he's gracious to be in all my all my movies. He's has worked in Atlanta radio. I brought him to Rhode Island radio. And he is just one of those great guys because his work ethic is seriously unbelievable. Just say my work ethic. We've done a morning show together, uh, which, of course... I think due to me working a lot and just just behind the scenes it was crazy, but we still respect each other. And he has hosted with the famous wrestler and manages a famous wrestler right now. And he does just so much other talent. His name is Vinny the Booch Bucci and Vinny the Booch.com, which you're seeing this on there too, if you're on the episode monthly show. Plus I do the Derek Shapiro Power Half Hour of the Cable Show ears on the Vinny the Booch.com as well. Okay. So without further ado, let me bring on Vinny the Booch.com. Vinny, well, Vinny Bucci. <laughs> yes. Thank, yes. Thank you for introducing me as my website, which by the way, uh, the annual renewal came in again, which, uh, yeah, Vin, Vinny is uh, broke because of that right now. Yes. And, uh, <laughs> well, still can't get this. Ma- is it 10 years? We've been friends. Still can't get him to chip in for the site. Well, I'll put it up. I'll, I'll put it this way: 
I, 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 I do my I do my best best advertising your website on so many other websites platform, and I put your name VinnieTheBoots.com on so many posters. And the thing is, I'll just put it this way: one of the reasons why I can't help out is because my rent, this place where I'm living now in Cranston, Rhode Island, went up from. I used to pay a thousand dollars a month. Guess how much I'm paying now a month over here? How much you paying over there? Fourteen hundred dollars a month. Damn. But in the winter time, the electric I had electric heat, so electric heat was expensive. This is unlimited heat, so I don't know if it's going to be equivalent or whatnot. But and plus, my internet uh, went up over here. Guess how much I was paying for internet in in, in up in Salem? How much? Twenty dollars a month. All right. Guess how much I'm paying now? Fifty. Yes. I literally just guessed. As listen out there, that was a total guess. He did not. He didn't prep me before the interview. I literally just that was a shot in the dark. Yeah. So, so my internet money's going up a month plus my rent, but minus the heat in the winter time. So I don't know, you know. Yeah. But but um, on that note, Vinny, you. I met you back at Bogies, uh, yes. back in Duluth, Georgia. Right? Was that was that in Duluth? Yes, Bog- Bogies was in Duluth, Georgia. I'll tell the story. Okay. Um, I was hosting a comedy show at the time. It was my first time ever hosting my own event, but I wanted to start making money as a comic, and I found this was going to be the best course of action. So at the time, I was on the regular guys and. And during this time, this was like the height of my fame on TRG. Like, 2011 is is in the top three greatest years of my life, was 2011. That was one of the greatest years I've ever had in my life. Because you met Derek Shapiro. Um, that's a side effect. But, you know, um, but the thing is, I, 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 so I wanted to host a show. So I went to Bogies because when I worked at Home Depot, a, bu- a friend who worked there, his wife ran the place. So yes. that's how I got the in. Okay, because his wife sponsored me, yes. sponsored my show, and and then she said that you got to meet this guy, Vinny Bucci, or, or he does a show here. And so I came on that night, and I broadcast your show live. Yes, I did. He did not get permission, by the way, to do that. But the first show, you did not ask my permission. The second show, you did. Yes. Um, but um, anyway, we were – I was doing the show, and after the comedy show, they did karaoke, which I had no idea how obsessed the people were here with karaoke. But, like, they acted like we invaded their turf. Like, <clears throat> they, the karaoke people – did not like us, despite the fact. And Derek, you were there, so you can vouch for this. Yes. When I did, when I had that first Booch Fest show, better yet, when I did both of them, how packed was that bar? You know, was I, I not a packed house both nights? I, I I cannot say, but I believe you. Um, um because, because your word is, you never lied to me, so I cannot really say how packed it was because I don't even know what I ate for dinner yesterday. You know well, what I'm I'll saying? I'll tell you what it was from the front to the back. Stay yeah. front to the back of that bar was filled with people. Probably because I saw a lot it of people coming. Standing yeah. room in the back. It was filled to the masses, and and it, and it is the thing. It was all because of the regular guys. They promoted it, so the people came. Exactly. And that was, and this is before Jerry was even on the show, so he was there helping me. But Jerry wasn't even on the show yet. He hadn't shown up yet. I don't think. I don't no, think he was on the show yet. No, he wasn't yet. But he was on the verge of showing up. And then I booked this show. We go out there. The place is packed. I see you. We start talking a little bit. And then eventually you came into the regular guy studio for a day. Then you tried to call in during regular guy squares. So they got familiar with you. They found you and they... They found you annoying. Uh, this is why they never brought you back. Um, <laughs> not, being, not, not being a jerk. I'm just saying that's the truth. No. I can't control that. But I will say this, though. And I make jokes about Derek, but I'll say this. People want to know, how the hell did I stay friends with this guy for 10 years? You want the secret? 
Here it is. And this is me being per perfectly honest. Derek is hands down one of the top three most annoying people I've ever met. Huh, huh, huh. Hands down. Uh, one of the most annoying people I have ever met. That's me. But he is a genuine good person. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You that's, are too. That's what I'm saying. That's really it. Like, he's a genuine good person, you know? Is he? Is all his content great? Not all of it. Uh, his, his movies, there are some movies he's done I thought, holy crap, this is going to be great. There are some movies I'm like, I can't believe he talked me into this. But that's the thing. The fact that Derek is a good person is why I want to work with him. And then I see the things he does right. I see the things he does wrong. I help him try to fix it. And some things we just don't see eye to eye on. But that's what made this friendship work. The fact that he's a genuine good person. So when he asked me to be part of something, I got no problem doing it. And also, too, I think – we haven't touched the um, the meat and the potatoes. Like, off the ear, if you have a problem, which I don't say this all the time, but I, I can admit it now. Uh, um, I'm off the ear. We don't just have a work relationship. If, if you're stressed out with your dad going through something or your mom going through something or if I'm going through something, I mean, you know, through the 10 years, when I first met you, my daughter was 11. My son was what, 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 was five. Now my son is 15. My daughter is 21 now. Just turned 21. Yeah. Like, you remember my kids were little. I remember. And, and of course, through the 10 years, um, well, the, the beginning part of our, 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 our work relationship, yeah, I brought Vinny, and we did a lot of shows together. We did a lot of showcases in Ackworth. Yeah, Woods, a lot of charity events. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of them. And then you, you got to meet Melissa Rose. Um, yes. And we're still still friends with her today. Well, you are. I, I, have, I lost touch with her. Have you spoke to her recently? Yeah. Really? Um, the last time I, I didn't really like really like talk to her, talk to her. Like she, I think she has a new podcast she's starting. She brought that up to me. But the last time I saw her like face to face was at a wrestling show. This is actually kind of funny. Uh, I, obviously Melissa spells her name differently than most people. Yes. Like, the standard. Spelling for Melissa is M E L I S S A. She spells it M I L Y S S A. She has her own spin on it. Well, one day, this is when I was dating this this girl at the time. Um, I was I was dating this girl at the time. We're driving in my car, and I have my phone mounted on the dashboard, and a text pops up, and it says, "Hey, Vinny, it's Melissa," but she had a different she she had changed her number or something. And she said, it's Melissa, but it was spelled regularly. She said, I can't wait to see you on Saturday. So, so yeah, yeah, yeah we, we had a share of crazies. <laughs> um, um, oh, we, oh, yes, we had. Yes. But, but it was funny because, you know, I introduced you to a lot of my friends, like my friend Stacy Lewis, who actually played yeah. your, played your girlfriend in the movie. Um, 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 uh, I introduced you to Melissa. I, uh, you introduced me to Jerry Truman, who I really haven't spoken to in a while, but I'm still friends with him on Facebook. So you, uh, I get to be friends well, with Jerry. Well, Jerry. I've also introduced you to um, I introduced you to Gator. That didn't work out. Uh, I introduced Elvis. You to Elvis. Elvis, yeah. Um, Desmond. Your, your brother, um, Sonny. My brother, Sonny, yeah. And and, um, and, and your dad. I'm friends with your dad, but I, don't, I really don't speak to him. I'm friends with him on Facebook. And, of yeah. course, your mom is a sweetheart. Every time I, I speak to your mom, Absolutely. she... She is awesome, you know. Uh, well, there's another friend of mine you've met too. Um, oh, Cr um, Kristen. Kristen, yeah, who I worked with at Depot and Lowe's. And then, of course, um, um, who, um, our lady uh, Christina, right? Um, Christina Wellman. Yes, yes. Uh, Spacey. Spacey, but um, her name's Spacey, Christina. Yeah. Christina Spacey. Uh, um, it's just been a real privilege just to know you and 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 just to honor our friendship for the past ten years. Yeah. And and you know us doing radio, doing you're doing your projects. I mean, when I first met you, met, you were for Home Depot. I I did mortgages down there. And I, I even, what, you were doing mortgages. I was doing well part time. I was doing mortgages, like being in the call center, you know. And, okay. And 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 me working for Walmart for the past six years. Now we both quit. Like you quit Lowe's, you quit Home Depot. I quit Walmart. It's like I moved. 
from Georgia to Massachusetts and now to Rhode Island now, literally. Yeah. And I just found a ticket in this bag over here I got at my parents' house before I, I, I did this interview. I literally saw an old ticket at the Gwinnett Braves against the Pawtucket Red Sox August 14th, 2011. That was a month after I met you. Yeah. So we, uh, because we met in July 2011, right? July, well, yeah, July 2011, because that was when the two episodes of Booch Fest happened. Yep. Um, so, that, yeah, I definitely remember that was definitely in July. And yeah. then we did about four shows there before ultimately uh, there was a falling out. And then they, they and then a few months after they canceled my show, they went out of business. Uh, <laughs> so That's a sign. I don't think so. That's a but sign. Anyway, huh? That's a sign. Yeah. And then they got, and then another place took it over and another comedian got, grabbed the spot and ran it for a while, which is fine. Good news, by the way. You know how you said um, in the past, get a girlfriend? Yeah. Well, I, um, you know how we go to Philadelphia sometimes? Yeah. Well, this is a surprise. But uh, I've been dating one of your cousins named Bucci. Okay, um, Derek. Yeah. So, so oh, I, it's almost gonna be like that time I might propose, and, and wait, 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 Derek. Yes, we're gonna be cousins. The cousins I know that I have in Philly. There's four of them. Yes. If you're dating any of them, yes, you are the creepiest human being on earth. Because they are all very, 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 very young, like in their like in early. I'm talking late teens, early twenties. Oh, oh, One of them is in their third, is in their thirties, and if you're dating her, uh, God help you. It um, is. That's her. No, I yep. guarantee you, it's not because she's she's already has a boyfriend. I know, and and, and she's cheating on him. No, she's a better, better person than that. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> See, I can't fall for that because I know the type of person she is. She don't cheat. Yeah, I get her fa- fall for that because it's fall? You know, no, anyway. Um, yeah. anyway. I mean, I'm just saying, you're, if you're dating the other two, you're creepy as hell because they are way too young, bro. All right. Way too young. Like. All right. Well, Vinny Bucci, thank you very much. Hi, I'm River. I'm 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 doing the caper show for Thanksgiving, and um, also I don't, I just want to say that be thankful, and um, and I love my family, and um, November Thanksgiving in next month in November, love you all, happy birthday to Dylan next month and. And Garner, and um, Bruce. Yep, love you guys. God is love. Peace out. So of course you saw a surprise message from my son River. He wanted to do that on his own terms. So he he was part of this show. Of course, he might not co-host with me today. He'd rather be by himself today in his own segment. I can't blame him. He is the star of the show, isn't it? Isn't he? <laughs> Way to go, River. I love you. And uh, thank you for that to my son and again to my daughter, London. Hi, Derek Shapiro here to tell you that Starting Over, written, directed, and starring myself, Derek Shapiro, comes out Thursday, Thanksgiving Day, November 25th, 2021 on movieinternetchannel.yoldosite.com and movieinternetchannel.godaddysites.com on the front page. And put on YouTube, Starting Over, movie. Derek Shapiro. Stop on myself, Derek Shapiro, and my son, River. What's that? Not good. Doc, well, you were outside. You should have been inside for the performance, you know, Wally? Well, I could have went. I could have stayed in the car. Also starring Serenity Rose and Bruce. Hey, how you doing, Garden? Bruce, what's going on? It's going. So, tell me, why are we over here at the former uh, beef barn? Well, I bought it. I'm going to be opening a restaurant. What's the name going to be, Bruce? Can't tell you that. Can you tell me? It's a surprise. It's a surprise. And starring Vinny the Booch Bucci. The Honorable.
Honorable Judge Justice for All presiding. Thank you. You may be seated. Oh, I can be seated? Thank you, Judge. Yes. Thank you, Mr. Greg. You're welcome, Mr. Gregory. And starring Dylan Schneider and Evans A. Darylis. Hey, Brother hey, Gabriel! Hey, what's going on? Yes, great to see you. I know yeah, it's early too. in the morning. I know it's like 8 o'clock in the morning, but I have some great news for you. What is it? Hi, Attorney uh, Franklin. Hey, how's it going? Great. It was so good of your brother, you know, uh, Gregory, to set me up with you, you know, and uh, get me, you know, to for the adoption for Wally. You know, Wally's a great kid, you know? Yeah, he definitely, definitely is from what I was about. And starring James, Buddy Love Herring. Uh -huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. My, my, my brother, he's an attorney. Okay. Really? Oh, your yeah. younger brother, huh? Yeah, I remember he's that. an attorney. And starring newcomer, Jessica. Mm. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Samantha. And guest starring the Naked Cowboy, live in Manhattan. Wow, the Naked Cowboy, how you doing? My name's Greg. Greg Robert, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. I'm the Naked Cowboy. And here's my new song, My Father's Eyes, the old Eric Clapton song. When I look in my father's eyes, my father's eyes. Starting over, comes out Thanksgiving Day at midnight, November 25th, 2021. A movie internet channel dot yo this dot com and movie internet channel dot go dot to come and in YouTube just put in starting over movie Derek Shapiro. To see you again, you know. Derek Shapiro here at Citadel Broadcast. Oh no 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 Cumulus. Not Citadel. Cumulus back in the day was Citadel. In Sal the rain. Salty Brian Broadcasting Studio. Salty Brian. But Billy Gummins here. You did a great job of hosting with Giovanni and Kim. Thank you. But um um just a quick thing for my cable show and my radio show, Billy. What's been up with you? I, I I know you're doing a lot of touring throughout the U.S. Yeah, right now getting back to normal. COVID, you know, delayed everything. Yes. Uh, but getting back to normal, and it feels great to see all of you again. Yes. It really does. And, 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 and the first time you um, I ever interviewed you was via phone when I saw the Derek Shapiro show. 2011 was via oh phone, and, and Angela got that, you know, your, your manager. Yeah, Angela, yeah, yeah. Angela Bakari. Cool. And then, of course, the second time I interviewed you was Dunkin' Donuts event. A part of a 92 Pro FM. Yes, thing. 92 Pro FM. Give That's a shout right. out because I interned for Mike Butts back in the day. Remember Mike wow, Butts back absolutely. in the day? Absolutely, back in the day. Back in the day. And I, 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 I know Kim and Gio a little bit, you know, saying and called up the show. So, but uh, you know, but hearing you on the radio, you should really, really. Um, 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 have your own show over here. Hey, you never know. Or, or, or even on, on the country station, too, because I know a country, you know. Absolutely. Uh, by the way, my parents' birthday's coming up, you know. Oh, and, that's and, awesome. and I don't know if we could sing happy birthday together. For, for What's your them. names? Howard and Janice Shapiro. Can we do a duet, can we? Sure. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, birthday dear Howard and Janice, Janice Shapiro. Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. From Billy Gelman and, and Derek. And yes. <laughs> Take care. Thank you very much. All right, from Cranston, Rhode Island, my first show here. Um, I want to thank everybody for watching and joining me, of course. Um, and, of course, uh, catch me weekdays, Monday through Friday, D Shop of the Morning, 6 to 9, on the networks of Derek Shapiro Show.com, Lena Channel 1, DSSTVStation.com, Country Music.com, Country Music.com, um, as well as Gossip Radio TV, .com, Gossip Radio TV, .com, as well as um, 90s, 2000s, 2010s, TV.yolosite.com, danceworldradio.yolosite.com, danceworldradio.yolosite.com, vinnythebooster.com, and on rivradio.yolosite.com, Spotify, and anchor.fm. In addition to that, don't forget the new Gossip News, Monday through Friday and Sundays, 7 o'clock, gossipradiotv.yolosite.com, gossipradiotv.yolosite.com, and the Proactive Radio Top 40 Countdown Show, every Sunday, 9 o'clock in the morning, ProactiveRadio.com, ProactiveRadio.YOLASA.com. Thank you much for watching. Listen, we'll see you next month, December, for the best of Derek Shapiro Power Half Hour. Outside, Calvin Harris featuring Ellie Golden, Derek Shapiro for Derek Shapiro's Power Half Hour, Season 6, 2021. Look what you've done. Stand still, falling away from me. When it takes so long, fire's out, what do you want to be? Now I'm holding on, myself was never enough for me, gotta be so strong.